many states are moving towards reopening certain businesses, but across the nation, people continue to work from home. Kids also learning from home, and everyone's online, which in many cases is lending, uh, leading rather to slow internet. But there are some simple solutions to help. Double Tenet reports. Like millions of Americans, CNET tech expert Dan Ackerman is working from home. So is his wife. His son is taking classes, and his mom is with them as well. I've got four people here in the house right now, and we're all online all the time. Ackerman says if your internet seems slow, you may want to check the speed. There are several speed tests online. Most households only need download speeds of 35 to 50 megabits per second. More than 100 is considered fast. Upload speeds of 10 or even higher may be needed if your day involves uploading files or video conferencing. Now, the secret is you don't just do it in one place. You go around to different places in your house. You try it in the bedroom. Room. You try it in the living room. Internet connections could be weak in parts of the house depending on the location of your Wi-Fi router. Leaving it under or behind furniture can hurt the signal. Take that router, uh, make sure it's not behind a closed door, maybe put it up on a shelf so it's a little higher. And many Wi-Fi routers show two options for your device to join the network, including the 5 gigahertz band or 5G for short. It's two different bands, 2.4 gigahertz band and the 5 gigahertz band. Now, generally speaking, the 5 gigahertz band is faster, but the range is not as good as the 2.4. So further away, you may get a more stable signal if you switch to the 2.4. 90% of the time, your devices and your router will choose automatically for you which one is best. If that doesn't help, a Wi-Fi extender may improve performance. Several companies now sell devices that connect to give your signal a boost. Each one of them is its own router, but when you put them together, they seamlessly form a mesh network that cover your entire house very well. And having good coverage can help ensure everyone logged on in the house stays connected. Nisha Medina, CBS News, San Diego, California. There you go.